Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of our Bangkok series. In this exciting vlog, we pick up right where we left off, at the vibrant Chaduchak Market in the heart of Bangkok. Join me as we immerse ourselves in the lively atmosphere, explore unique stalls, and of course, indulge in some mouth-watering street food. Despite arriving a few hours before the market closes, we're determined to make the most of our time here. Get ready for a shopping spree as we explore unique local crafts, trendy fashion, and quirky souvenirs. And what's a Bangkok adventure without a relaxing Thai massage? So stick around as Key experiences her first Thai massage. Now without further delay, let's get this vlog started. Okay, we made it to Chat to Chat Market. Yeah, let's eat first and then we'll start. Thank you, Kapong Kap. Go this way. Okay, we made it to Chatuchak Market. This is the entrance of Chatuchak Market. So you enter through here. And usually they have people here who give you pamphlets, but there's no pamphlets now. And this is the map. So this is how big the market is. This is only on the weekends. The first thing we're doing is looking for some food. But if you check that mother vlog, it looks just like how it was before. Just a couple months later. So this is, I believe, the first road or the main road that you'll see. As you can see, there's tons of people here because it's a weekend market. So let's go search for some food. Chaduchak Market, often referred to as JJ Market, stands as one of the largest and most diverse markets in not just Bangkok, but the entire world. Nestled in the northern part of the city, this sprawling marketplace spans over 35 acres, boasting more than 15,000 stalls. Um, you can ask him? Oh, over there. You sit right there. Wow. Thank you so much. But this is a big portion. So the lady was really nice. I got a little worried because I wasn't sure what the brown pieces were. So they made me a brand new one. How much? It's a big plate. So I got a fresh one. All right, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, it's really good. Mm. Yeah, it's good. I'm hungry, so. It's a lot, but I try my best to finish it. What you think, Keith? Delicious. So if you want to try this food, this is where it's located. So as AC, if you want to try it, this is how it looks. There you go, cooking the pad thai. So this is where we want to eat. This is how it looks from the side. From the main road. There are those big prongs. Look at this. Three for 120. So I'm guessing three of these packs. That's not bad. Look what I found. Brooklyn. The shirts here are 100 baht. It's actually not bad. So cool. Nice. Nice. Which one do you like? It's only a hundred, it's not bad. Got these pants for 150 and these shirts for 290. It's really nice. 
This is nice. One of the most appealing aspects of shopping for women's clothing at Chattachak Market is the affordability. The prices are generally reasonable, especially considering the quality and uniqueness of the items. From budget-friendly fonts to more exclusive pieces, Chattachak accommodates various budgets, making it an excellent destination for both thrifty shoppers and those looking to splurge on a special wardrobe edition. Yeah. There's also this place here and they have all this incense. They also have this. This is their promo. This is nice. Probably I'm allergic to it though. <laughs> These shirts are only 80 baht. Look all the nice colors. They even got this green one. Oh, it's pretty thick too. Oh, Shane. Yellow. Pink. Now this shirt I was actually looking for, but are they closing? Just want to get some black tees in here. So they got these shirts here for a hundred baht. Well, depending on the size. And I got two of these, just plain black tees. They're thin though, but if you want the thick one, it's on the other side. Not bad. I think this one is oversized. It's soft though. Maybe I might want to get one of these because that one is stiffer for 150 oh, maybe i just don't like the long sleeve that's nice so it's 200 baht for any of these dresses I think they're branded too. It is now 5.54. The Chatter Chat Market is closing, unfortunately. So it's cute. Fine size. They got all these different stones. Oh wow, look. Look what I found, Jay. Muay Thai. Look at these kids' Muay Thai shorts. The infamous elephant pants. 100 baht. And they also have these elephant dresses. Oh wow, they got incense. I love incense. I 
They even have these little holders. Oh, this one got elephants on it. Now we came across this section right here. It just looks like random stuff. We have some plants. Look at this. Over here they have four for a hundred jewelry. It's like costume jewelry. That's nice. Look, Kirsten, you gotta step your game up. <laughs> this is nice. Oh, this is cool. This is amazing. So we found this aisle that has all of these paintings. Simone, if you're watching, check this out. thirsty right now so let's try this out look Jim I'm trying something new I got this one grass jelly mixed tea 50 baht wow thank you We have this pajama set for a hundred baht. Look all the colors. They even have plain stripes. Only for a hundred. It's great. Okay, thank you. Look at his shirt. It's like a polo remix. It's nice though. It's different. So these are 590 each. Okay. What other ones? Just pull any of them. They have all of these tote bags, roughly 100, 120. They have all of these amazing bags here too. Not quite sure how much they cost, but they really look nice. He got me here waiting on mine to get these meatballs, pork meatballs. But they're only 35 baht, I believe, for seven pieces. So everyone's online for these pork meatballs. Let's see how good they are. Key, you excited?
กี่ลูกคะสิบเอ็ดIs what he got. It's popular. We got this airbrush body paint. <laughs> so if you want to get an airbrush, you can come right here. Look what he found. Yeah, different now. Some socks. Where you come from, yeah? New York City. You. I'm from New York. Oh, New York, yeah. Where Key? you from, Ki? Tell me. Chinese, Philippines, huh? She look Chinese, right? Okay. Are you new buy me a pair? Do you want? What do you want? The last. Um. Oh no, good. Get yourself. It's fine. Six knuckles. I was gonna say these crocodiles are this egg. <laughs> no, I'm joking. Nah, I don't want. You know me. I just like wearing black socks. These are. You don't like this, so. That has like the cannon. This is included. Not <laughs> Yeah. Come over here and get socks from him. Eight four hundred. So I found this shirt. I like it, but it's probably too hot to wear out here. And they got a bunch of black ones. Looks like this. Found this area right here that sells a bunch of shoes, starting at 150. It's not the best option, but look what I found, guys. New York bagel. I should try it. It tastes like a New York bagel. He's gonna try this out. She's gonna do a foot and shoulder massage. Is everyone? Relax. This place is popping. Everyone's shopping here. So Kian is getting a massage right now and I'm just gonna walk around for the next 45 minutes. But there's a lot going on. This market is until 12 o'clock, it's until midnight. So unfortunately, the inside of the market is closed. It closed down at six o'clock. We got the wrong information, but hey, it's fine. We were able to get a few things. So I'm super thirsty right now. I'm gonna get some coconut water. They have a vegan option. Hi. Uh, which option is vegan? Vegan, so you have this one. So this is how the blended coconut water smoothie looks. It's only 50 baht, so it's a little over a dollar. Maybe almost close to two dollars. Unfortunately, it has sugar in it, but that's okay. Just a little bit, it's fine. It's been about 40 minutes, so let's go check on Key. Let's see if she's done. Oh, check her out. That lady, the lady stretching her out. This lady is massaging Key. <laughs> Looking at, like she's having a good time. So I found where you can store your luggage. So if you come here with your luggage, you could actually come here and store it. Let me just show you. These are the sizes and this is how much you pay. So if you decide to come here straight from the airport, here's the price list and you could just choose which one. The 
pretty big ones. It's located right next to the MRT. If you plan on coming here by MRT, this is the stop. And then you would just walk right here, straight down these steps. And it is right here, the lockers to put your luggage. I was actually considering using this, so it's pretty interesting that I found it. All right, I got key. Now we found this night market. Let's check it out. They have fresh fruit, my mom. Of course, I'm listening to you, you said no cut fruit. That's pork. There's also chicken for 15 bucks. Hold on. Found these sausages here. There's also squid. They have all these different types of fried food. I guess these are prawns. And look at these little crabs. We have some more fried food. I think these are wontons. And I think this is just breaded sausage and eggs. We were looking all over for this. The slushy drink. We found these fried squid eggs. I think these are quail eggs and back to the fried squid. I think Kian is going to get this. She's going to try it. Check this out. Not bad. Sorry. So I got this loofah. This is where I got it from. I'm Aroma. Oh, Key's buying it. Look, James, they have a diffuser. It's only 100 bucks. And it comes in all these different scents. So these two are the most popular. These are specific to Thailand, or that's what the man said. But we're into these. Well, I like peppermint. And this ocean smells pretty good. And so does this white tea. But this is very common. This one smells like something I've smelled at with um, Glade. I think Glade makes something very similar. It's 8.43 p.m. right now, and we're going to check out the mall. So unfortunately, the mall is shut down. I mean, it's still open, but as you can see, everything's closed. Everybody is closing up their shops. It is 8.46. We're going to look for an exit that the taxi could pick us up at. Everything is shutting down. We are officially done. Chatter Jack Market is shutting down and it is time to go home. Our grab came, thank God. So, what do you come? Where are we going to? Bangkok City Hotel. Okay. This is how we're ending the night. Finally made it back. It is 918. Okay, hitting 19. Let's go. Okay, let's check out where the washroom washing machines are located. 17. Over here. 
Oh, I think you just have to pay for it though. That's fine. 30 to wash. But then where's the soap? Kian decided to leave me. Where's this girl? What happened to you? What happened? I knew it. <laughs> I said, where is she? This looks nice. It looks nice. I guess it's okay. Here. There you go. Thanks for joining me on another unforgettable journey. Keep an eye out for our upcoming video as we embark on an e-scooter tour across Bangkok, arranged through Go City. If you enjoyed this vlog, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more adventures, and hit that notification bell so you won't miss out on the next exciting episode. Until then.